Welcome to Everything Valves, the channel dedicated to bringing you Everything Valves. Thank you for those supporting this channel. If you enjoyed today's video, please like and subscribe for more valve videos. In today's video, we will be looking at a threaded check valve. This is a two inch carbon steel threaded check valve. This valve is rated to 5,000 PSI. In these drawings, you can see two variations of swing check valves. One is a carbon steel swing check valve rated to 5,000 PSI, and the other is a ductile iron swing check valve rated to 2,000 PSI. Both valves are similar in design, but vary in pressure. They both come with repair kits that consist of the disc, the seat o-ring, and a bonnet o-ring. Disassembly. Here you have the valve. This right here is called the bonnet or cap. You have the body. You're going to want to unthread the bonnet from the body. So let's unthread it. I've already loosened it. We're going to unthread it completely from the body. Here's a closer look at the bonnet. As you can see, it has a O-ring here at the top that creates the seal. This is made out of a Viton material. Then you have the threads. Here you have a port right inside with a plug that you can remove to add any instrumentation. Here's a look inside of the valve body without the bonnet. You can see the clapper there inside of the body slot. The flow will come in this direction and push the clapper up. You can see the clapper freely hanging and swinging inside there. To remove the clapper, you're going to want to grab the clapper, push the clapper away from the body seat, and pull the clapper up out from the body slot. Here you have the clapper. As you can see, it is one solid piece with a O-ring on top. This is the O-ring that creates the seal. Here is the body with everything removed. There's the slot for the clapper on top. Inside right here is the body seat sealing surface. This is where the O-ring will sit and create the seal. So here's the valve. You have the body, you have the clapper with the O-ring, and the cap with the O-ring. Assembly. To assemble the valve, you're going to take your body, verify that there's no debris in the clapper slot, make sure that inside of the valve port there's no trash or debris, and that your body seat sealing surface is clean. You want to take your clapper, make sure your o-ring is not damaged. Verify that it is tight and secure on the clapper itself. Take your clapper and line up the slot with the body and place in the body slot and push down. Make sure that it's securely fastened down. Apply pressure and make sure that the clapper freely swings and does not fall out. You're going to take your bonnet or cap, make sure that your O-ring here at the top is clean and there's no damage and that the threads are clean and clear and thread it into the body. Verify that your bonnet is securely tightened down into the body and then take the valve and verify that the clapper is still swinging freely. Make sure that it moves and there it is assembled. If you enjoyed today's video, please like and subscribe. 
Thank you for watching and please stay tuned for more Valve videos.